school bags to show you what is in our school backpack. So if you're wondering why do you have these really ugly backpacks and we don't get a choice on what backpack we get to use, we literally have to use these ones from our school. So for privacy reasons, we've covered up our school logo. Um, as you can probably tell, we have different school backpacks because we don't actually go to the same yes. school. A lot of people think we do, but we don't because yeah. we actually don't live together. We're cousins. Yes. So let's just show you guys what is in our school bag. So as you can tell, our school backpacks are very dirty, very disgusting a bit, but you know what? They work. <laughs> so we don't actually change and get new backpacks every single year because they're the same and also they're really expensive. So I'm going to stick to this one. Also, one more thing before we start, this backpack, I'm not sure, is yours really heavy? Probably, yeah. These backpacks are really heavy and we weighed mine and my lunchbox wasn't even packed and my drink bottle wasn't packed and it was like seven or eight kilos. Like, that's kind of insane. Yeah. Like, schools, get your act together. I know. Anyways, let's actually get straight on into this. So in my first pouch, I have a little cute hand sanitizer. Got my little Bath and Body Works spray. It's really dirty, oh my gosh. This is really good for after PA class. because like, Oh yeah, it's a bit stinky after PA mm -hmm. class. I'm gonna be real. <laughs> and then in here, I also have two lip balms. Got my Blistex lip conditioner. And then this, I think this is um, lip, lip smacker. Wait, what is your one? Oh, chapstick, I'm not really sure. This is weird, but that's cool. Yeah, it's chapstick. I've actually also got three um, lip balms in my school blazer pocket, so yeah. I'm never gonna have chapped lips, pretty much. And then, of course, I also have my house keys. They're really cute. It's got a little llama. I actually got this from a Kawaii box. So we oh, oh, fun fact. <laughs> and then, for a cheeky little snack, I have some candy. Got some Lifesavers fruit tingles and some jelly beans. I actually got oh these jelly beans because whenever it's someone's birthday in our year level, you get a little thing of jelly beans, which is really nice. Oh my gosh. A little snack on the go. I don't get that. Um. <laughs> and then I also have my little first aid kit. So that just has like band-aids some like neurofin if I get a headache or something. The basic necessities. <laughs> and finally in my backpack, I have an EpiPen. Now I have anaphylactic allergies, so I need one of these in case I accidentally eat something I'm allergic to. Okay, what okay. Do you have in yours? And then in front of my pouch, I actually don't have that much. I have, well here, so I've got a USB because at school we always do like lots of projects and stuff and sometimes we need to like display them on the board or give them to the teacher. So it's always handy to have a USB, that's my tip. Also I have this like little zip thing from Smiggle. Yes, I used to always get it. Oh my god, I also have this power bank. So this is a portable charger and I've actually been looking for this for a really long time and I've been using my sisters. I got this for Christmas and now I know where it is. It's, but it's not charged. Yeah, yet. it's not charged at all. So at least we know. Yeah, I always find the weirdest stuff in my front pocket. Yeah, I'm like just all my jumpers in there. And then finally in the front pouch, I just have this little silver sparkly pencil pouch. And inside of it, I just have a few things. I have my stress relief hand sanitizer because School can get stressful, definitely. And then I just have my Lucas Pawpaw ointment, aka a lip balm. And then I just have some hair ties and some bobby pins in case my hair falls out. And a perfume, because again, gym class can get a bit stinky sometimes. <laughs> Sorry guys, I just turned my bag to the side because this thing on the front's coming off and my school stinky logo is not sticky. Yeah, yeah, my school logo is showing. Anyways, so in the second pouch, if you can't tell, we have three different pouches. In the second pouch, I have a few different things. Here, I'll go first this time. I have a really big umbrella. Why is it so big? I don't know, but currently here in Australia, it is winter and it's raining so I much. I know, and some days I have to walk home. So this is just really handy because otherwise I'm gonna get drenched. <laughs> and then I have my pencil case. Some people, do you leave your pencil case at school? Um, usually. Yes, yeah, so some people leave their pencil case at school, but I like to take it home just when I'm doing homework. I've got everything in there. And then, oh my gosh, I have so much in this front pouch. I'll, then I've just got my school lunchbox. Well, usually the only thing I really have in this pouch is my lunchbox. Oh, that's pretty simple. And then my Chloe. Oh, actually, I've got a lot of junk in here. Same. I've got a lot of junk in this pouch. I have an umbrella, and I keep my drink bottle. And then I've just got some junk, including money and 
a charm. Oh my gosh, you've got so much stuff. An old chocolate Easter egg. That's Ew. kind of really gross. Okay. Oh, hang oh, on. Don't. Why do I have a gummy worm in here? <laughs> Ew, that's so yuck. Okay, never mind. The front pouch is in the pouch where you put all your rubbish. This middle pouch is. So in my middle pouch, I also have this book because currently at school we're reading The Boy in the Striped Pajamas. So that is so my sad. reading book. I know, I literally cried so much while reading that. And then, oh my, okay, so my pencil case is kind of spilt a bit. So I have a lot of pens and pencils and lip balms <laughs> at the bottom. I did not know that spilled. I have my school hat, but I'm not going to pull that out because, again, with the school logo. I do have a school hat. Yeah. I school hat. And then, I, okay. So, long story. I have a <laughs> unopened calculator because I needed a calculator because I lost my other one, or I like to say someone stole it. And then I bought one, and then my sister gave me one. And then it's still been sitting in my bag for like a semester. I think I need one of these calculators for next year so I can happily borrow one. Oh, you can take this because I don't need this next year. I need a new cat. I need to buy a new I need, calculator. I think I need this Casio one, honestly. Like, well, that, that's quite funny. And then in in this pouch, um, I'm scared. What? <laughs> and I don't have a pack of gummy snakes. I feel pretty sure these have been here since Athletics Day and Athletics Day was in term one, it's now term or like term one, it's like it's now like term four, three. Well, is it still like edible? They're really old, they weren't even mine. They're someone else's, they they're still edible guys, don't worry. Okay, well you know what I'm gonna be eating after this. And then finally I just have lots of rubbish and more pens. Why am I oh, wearing lip balm? Oh and another lip balm. You can tell we're obsessed with the balm. With our school bags, you just kind of build up things over time yeah. and Gets a bit messy. Yeah, as you can tell, we just definitely build up in some time. <laughs> and a quick side note, in my like side little pocket thing over here, I have this like swell tea holder that I bought in America. And basically I usually have a hot tea I take to school every morning because I leave really early and it is so cold so I need a tea to warm me up so I just have that. Oh uh, and in the side pouch of where the drink bottle goes, I actually just keep this drink bottle which Millie brought back from America for me. Thank you Millie. It's this really adorable Starbucks swell drink bottle and it's got like wings and like it's really, it's really cute. Everyone's complimenting me on this by the way. Thanks Millie. That was good. So first of all kind of the most important thing is my computer. I have my little Recon sticker up there from last year, so yep, kind of need that at school. And then I also have my school computer, however... Why is it in such a heavy case? Our school is like, if you don't carry your computer in your computer case, it's like, no, no. Yeah, it's kind of like, I feel like it's a part of like the warranty a bit. Mm. Pretty much, I have my big school computer inside of this. Again, not going to pull it out because it has my school logo on it. Oh, everything has my school logo on it, I swear. So then in this back pocket, I also have some school books and like notebooks. Usually I'll also have maybe like a textbook from like geography or whatever, but I actually don't have any here because I didn't get any like weekend homework. So you know, just some notebooks. Yeah, for us. and I also have some books in notebooks in here. I usually keep all my books at school. However, when I have homework I need to do over the weekend or even after school, I'll just bring them home. So I've just got my humanities book. This other notebook, and then where I keep all my tech, my test results, and A pluses. That's what we make Ooh. my mum believe. That's what we make my mum believe. <laughs> then in this back pocket, I also have my pencil case. Now, I usually leave it at school, but I was in such a rush to catch the train, I just threw everything in my bag. Oh, because it's like it comes at three o seven, and we finish at three, so you oh, gotta like yeah. run to that train. You station. gotta run. So I just got that in there. And then I also in this back pouch have my school diary slash daily planner. But again, with everything else, I'm not going to pull that out because that is also covered in my school logo because it's a school diary. We have to use that one. Gosh, yeah, it is. yeah, our school kind of gives us a lot of things covered in the school. Um, for some reason, I have another umbrella. So yeah, I'm not really sure I have two umbrellas. Probably need to take one of these out, but that's yeah. handy if I lose one. See. This, you never know what's in your school bag. And then finally, I have in my the last thing in my bag. I have this like little pouch at the top. Oh, and I some days on like PE days, I keep my phone in here because there's nowhere to put it on me. But I just have my school head my headphones because we have to listen to music at school and on the way to school. So I'm not sure. I, 
actually the rule at our school. I'm not sure whether you're meant to keep your phone in your bag, but some days I keep it in my bag, other days I just like keep it in my blazer or in my pocket mm -hmm. because Same. I'm just scared that someone's gonna find out my locker code and steal my phone. I have a few more things. Oh, really? Yeah. So first of all, I've got my glasses. Do you want to see what I look like in glasses? Don't think any of those things. I haven't shown you before. They're like really small because they're really old, but. Oh, you look so cute with glasses on. I also have glasses, but my ones do not actually fit me, so I really need, I've had an eye appointment recently, but I need to go back and choose a new pair of glasses. I think these are for like close dis short distance. For reading and short distance. Yeah, for reading and like looking at my computer, I don't know. Quick loop, look how cool this case is. It like flips all the way around. I'm yeah. sorry, is that not cool? It's really cool. And then, yeah, for some reason I have a ruler. Nice sparkling ruler. And this really weird floppy magnetic calculator. I have no idea why, but I do. And then, oh my gosh, I've got too much junk out here. Then I also have my headphones, which are like, what are they called? Wireless? They're wireless headphones. Mm -hmm. So you know. They're really cool. Yep. And then finally, I've got my little Minko purse with my money in it. Oh so yeah. I can buy from the cafe. I usually have my purse with my money in it, but I actually left that in my blazer pocket because I had to go to the canteen last week. Yep, and then I just have papers and lots of Yeah, lots of dirt. There's lots of like lots of dirt. Guys, I'm gonna get real with you for a second. There are lots of like old tests at the bottom. Honestly, same. I'm like, <laughs> I was just reading it now and I was like, dang, I think we're gonna test. <laughs> okay. Well, we've got a bit of a mess on the bed. I'm just going to show you the mess that we've kind of piled up on the bed. And keep in mind that we put all the stuff from our front pocket back in our front pocket, so this is just from two pockets of our bags. So yeah, as you can see, our bags can get a little bit messy, but they're organised, I promise. Without anything in my bag, actually, it's really light. My bag's really heavy without anything in my bag. It's like, so light. Oh my gosh. My bag without anything in it, currently it doesn't have anything in it, and it's like pretty heavy it just by is. itself. I don't know, who thinks, let's let's destroy these kids' backs. Let's yeah. make some very heavy Honestly, backpacks. some days after school, I'm like, oh my gosh, my back is so sore. And sometimes I, I can't even lift my bag. Like, I have to like put it on the bed and go like this. I'm like, three, yes. two, one, mom, help me. And then I have to like stand up. It's like so yes, hard. Yes, that's like so true. So we hope you guys have enjoyed seeing what is in our backpacks and thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to comment, like and subscribe and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! I'll put all these away now. Okay, here we go.